Hello everybody, my name is The Humble Gamer and welcome back to Subnautica Part 15, I think? I could be lost, I don't know. Uh, so in the last episode, we went back to the Aurora with the laser cutter to get all of the other stuff we could get there, including the prawn suit. Uh, in this episode, I have plans. I am going to go and find the um, mod... Uh, what is it called? The, the vehicle upgrade console, I think it's called. Um, which is what we can put in the moon pool here, and it will allow us to make the depth upgrades for the sea moth. Now, we're not actually going to be able to really do much before we can upgrade that, so we need to do that. Um, but that, that means I'm going to have to go to the grassy plateau. But <clears throat> before we go there, I am actually going to need to do a little inventory management, because, well, last episode I picked up a lot of stuff, didn't I? Um, look at this. Look at this fucking barrage of nonsense that I've got on me. Um, right, let me go downstairs, if I can find the bloody ladder. There we go, right. Um, I might try to build a compass, actually. It might be a, a, a thing to do. Um, actually, you know what, I'm, I'm building, I'm going to build another, um, another locker here so that I can store some of this other stuff that I've got. Did I, actually, didn't I store a bunch of stuff in here? Okay, no, that was, that was spare. Yeah, yeah, no, don't worry about that then. Let's just make another locker here. Uh, can we make it even? Can we... <laughs> My OCD demands even. Okay, there we go. I think that's even. I probably fucked that up. Whatever, it doesn't matter. We're only storing a couple of uh, things in here anyway. Yeah, store these posters. Um, well, actually, I could put these posters up, but I'm not bothered about them right now, so... Um... Oh, the fire extinguishers as well, yeah. Maybe we can bring some of the spares over from the locker as well under the life pod. So, a um, little bit slow to start, but we will get over to the wreckage, because I, I know I know exactly which wreckage I, I should be able to find the console upgrade in. I just have to go there. Oh, what? I could name these? Are you st Oh, you fucker. I was able to name those the whole fucking time. Shit. Alright, there's another poster. We'll take that. Uh, Cyclops engine efficiency module, I suppose we could... We could take that. But I might just leave it in here. I've got a couple of fire extinguishers. I should trash these. I should build a trash can now, because I could use it to get rid of some of this stuff that's taking up space, like these flares and stuff. In fact, yeah, we're going to do that. These two are, are fucking drained. Um, we'll leave the rest of these for now. I'm going to build a fucking uh, trash can. We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna throw out the trash, boys. Um, I think it's too titanium for a trash can. No, don't do that. I keep clicking on the names on the boxes instead of the actual box. Uh, right, where is the trash can? There you are, trash can, baby. Oh, oh, look at you, you, you fucking beaut. All right, I'm gonna stick you in a really aesthetic location, like right, right here, centered next to the uh, the plant pot. If I can just, yeah, that'll do. Fuck, <laughs> just just try to fucking get it in the right position. Okay, right, okay, um, so, what was it? It was the fire extinguishers, right? Fire extinguishers, and these two flares, because I never use flares. Um, we'll stick this other poster away. Um, I think I actually have two of those now. Yeah, prawn suit poster. <laughs> okay, right. So now, let's, um, uh, let's, let's go. Let's, let's go out and, uh, um, go hunting for that. Uh, wreck. I know it's in the grassy plateau, and we've seen it multiple times at this point. I just have to find it one more time, and this time I can actually go inside it. So let's just head to the outer reaches of the of, of the shallows here and see if we can find it. Oh, hello. Have I seen you before? I think I have. Some of these fish just seem to hide away from me, just out of my sight where I can't see them. Um... Well, of course, that's what they what it would mean. Out of my sight, it was where I can't see them. Oh, such a fucking idiot sometimes. Um, it should be on the grassy plateau somewhere. I have seen it before. Okay, there's the small wreck. I think it's over here. Maybe I'm starting to get my orientation right. I don't know. <laughs> I've had all these problems over time trying to get my orientation correct and know which way I'm bloody swimming. I'm still in the grassy plateaus here, so... I'm still in the potential good zone for finding this wreck. Hello? 
wreckage where are you no that's the mushroom biome well actually actually you know what there is going to be something in the mushroom biome as well so let's go looking in the mushroom biome where well, saying it twice makes me feel like i'm like losing my mind or something um yeah like somewhere along the bottom of the mushroom zone should be um i believe a cyclops piece but i can't be 100 percent sure so um it'd be good to find it though and just have it have it uh, gotten there is a wreck in the mushroom biome too actually um but i forget which mushroom biome it's in so we'll have to keep an eye out for that it is on top of one of the uh mushrooms um whichever mushroom biome it actually is in so uh oh that's lithium i didn't realize there'd be lithium hanging around here um yeah, I, I don't I don't think I can see it hanging around here, so let's head round this way. Try and head back. Um doesn't help that it's bloody night time. God, just fucking it fucks me. It fucks me over. Still pretty though. I still love looking at all of this. It's all very, very nice to look at. Um let's head back towards the grassy plateau then. We might have passed the wreckage, I don't know. Okay, it's turning daytime. That'll help us. Um, oh, God. Uh, there's, there was one thing I wanted to mention um, in, in this video, which, which I've managed to remember that I wanted to, to talk about, which is um, the Sub-Zero uh, uh, expansion for this game has actually been um, released, or, or is going to be released, sorry, in the next few days into early access. Uh, on PC, I think they they're trying to get early access out on on Xbox as well, Xbox One. But I I don't know if they'll be successful in that. But on PC, they they're bringing out early access for that. They said they don't know when they'll be able to get it to to, to consoles like properly, like the full release. But it's nice to know that they're working on it um, and that it's getting closer to being there. Aha! Here's one of the grassy plateau's wreckages. Perfect. Um, I think I've been in here before. Yeah, there's there's a door in there. Um, okay, maybe I haven't been in here before. There's loads of wreckage out here. I would have scanned all of this before if I'd been here before. Is there an easier way in? Hold on, I'm just going to see if I can find an easier way into this. Ah, here we go. There's, a, there's an opening right here. Okay, well this could be the one. This could be the one that gives us the, um, the upgrade thing. Uh, what, did, what did I just try to scan there. What? That was weird. I tried to scan something for a second there. That was really odd. Um, okay, well I've got plenty of air so let's... Um... Oh, wait a minute. I need my torch. Can't do shit without that. Um, okay, right. Let's um, have a little... Oh, okay. Now that's just another entrance in. Oh my god, this is going to be pretty weird. Trying to figure out where everything is in here. I, I think I've been in here before. Yeah, there's a door here. Maybe maybe there's like a laser cut door that I wasn't able to get through before. Yeah, I've definitely been in here. Yep, yep, there's the laser cut door that I wasn't able to get through. Okay, right, well. Who knows? Could be in here. Could be in any of these fucking wrecks. The whole idea of this particular episode for me is I want to get the upgrade console because then I can build the depth upgrades and we can start moving down deeper into the planet. Um, we can't get too deep uh, with the sea moth, um, but I know where the entrance is and I know where we can get down there, so... Um, let's... Oh, 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 please be, please be. Ult, lightweight ultra... Okay, well, I mean, it's... I guess it's good enough. <laughs> it's, it's good enough, boys. It'll do. Um, wait, what? Oh my god, the battery on my fucking um, um, scanner ran out. Oh my god, I completely forgot that that's a thing that can happen. Um, okay, <laughs> let's replace the battery for a second because I really need that to be um, working. Uh, oh, hold on. Alright, well, we've got battery charger, so we can actually charge these batteries back up now. Beautiful, okay. Uh, that's a modification station fragment. Already got that, buddy. Um... A sealed door. Oh, wait, I've already cut that open. What am I thinking? Uh, oh, there's an elevator down there. Oh, and I've just got electrocuted. Great. Um, okay, let's um, head back out. Very... Oh, okay, now let's scan this first one. Basic plant pot. 
Plant pots are actually pretty cool, and I didn't make use of them in my first playthrough, so I'll have to, I'll have to give those a try. Um, we got plenty of air here. Someone, someone's been watching my videos, by the way, from the uh, the Discord that I shared my my um, uh, uh, the, that I shared my thing in um, this this series. And um, someone commented that um, I made the mistake in like one of the first episodes of calling the bubbles water. Um, calorie intake recommended. Oh, right, okay, I can take one of the nutrient blocks now, cool. And I'll take another water too. All right. Yeah, so so I, I was uh, sitting over one of those uh, things that, that pops bubbles up to the surface, and I was saying it was giving me water when I should have been saying it was giving me air. So, yeah, I was... I was being a bit stupid there. I was being a bit stupid. Um, or oh, another battery fragment. Why not? More titanium. You know, I said it before and I'll say it many, many times. It's always good to have titanium. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 what about this? There it is. Vehicle upgrade console. Um, and, of course, I've run out of fucking battery power. That's wonderful. Okay, let's get my Seamoth out then. Um, and then my scanner back out. Okay. Because my Seamoth has light. Or my Sea Glide, sorry, not Seamoth. Okay, right. This is a propulsion cannon. We already have one, but that's fine. Um, okay, what else? What else? Anything else in here? There's more. That's a mo another modification station fragment. I'll have to make another locker to store all of this titanium. Um, but that's good. It, it, it means we've got like enough titanium to do whatever we want to do for now. For a, quite a while, actually. So... Uh, we are going to start needing to make titanium ingots, um, especially for when we start building like the proper stuff that we need. Um, oh well, the the prawn suit and the cyclops anyway, which we will need eventually. Unfortunately, we can't get down to the bottom without them. Um, all right, I think that's everything. Um, but thank God, I mean, this means I don't have to explore any more of these wrecks for a little bit. So okay, right, let's find our way out of this bloody thing. Um, and we out, boys. Let's get back to base. Oh my god, that's great. I can't believe I managed to successfully do that. What a successful mission. Um, at least I knew where I was going so that I didn't have to get lost and, I don't know, like spend a whole episode wandering around looking for the bloody wreck. Um, I didn't have much to talk about today, to be honest, other than the, the Subnautica Below Zero uh, coming into early access. Um... I do actually, I need to remember to, to do the whole looking around my room thing, because I, I remember saying it in a previous episode, if I look around the room, everything in here has a story so I could talk about it, but I just didn't, I didn't remember to do that in, in videos I've recorded since then, so how, how about, uh, let's have a little look around, um, oh, how about, <clears throat> on my bookshelf, I've got the, um, uh, two of the three Dark Horse Comics Zelda books, uh, there's actually officially four, um, but I've got two of them. And there's a third one, which I think is the Hyrule Encyclopedia or something like that. Um, I've got the Hyrule Historia and the Art and Artifacts book, but the Encyclopedia I haven't got. Um, and I've picked up those books because I really like the idea of seeing some of the concept art for the Zelda games. Um, and it is actually really cool to get like a genuine history of, of how the games were developed and um, how they became what they are today and stuff. It's, it's actually really cool. Um, but... You know, I, I, I spent the money on it so that I could read it, and I read it, and now it's just sitting on my shelf doing nothing, and I don't know if I'll ever read it again, <laughs> which is sad, really, when you think about it, because they are, they are great books, and, and Zelda is a great franchise, you know, I, I have thought many times about doing uh, videos on Zelda, I mean, I can't right now, but if there was ever a game that I would be eager to do um, a series on, if I had the ability, it would be a Zelda game, because they are really fun. Um, and they go on for a while too, so you can get a lot of a lot of uh, a lot of fun out of them. Okay, right. Let me um, figure out what it costs to make a battery charger: copper wire, wiring kit, and titanium. Okay, well that's that's easy. That's um, uh, this is more titanium, right? So one titanium, um, two copper for the. Oh no! I need another copper, boys. Ah, oh, shit. I'm gonna have to go out mining for copper eventually. Oh, and I've left me silver in the other bloody, um, thing, haven't I? Oh, wait, I put it in here, didn't I? Ah, here we go. Another wiring kit. Perfect. 
Um, okay, let's hunt a, a copper quickly. Make a wiring kit and a copper wire. Um, and then we can build a battery charger, which would be very useful to have. Um, because we can recharge power cells via the uh, the CMOS, essentially, but, but uh, batteries will just die. And the only way to fix that problem will be to get new ones, unless we have a charger. Um, and you can charge four batteries at a time, which is great, but it does use up the power that you absorb from, from the sun, so you got to be careful about that. Um, oh my god, I've, I've left no limestones for myself around here. Ah, here we go. That's a titanium. Um... Hello, little, little limestone rocks. I need your copper. I need a, I need a copper to come help me. Ah, uh, here we go. Copper. Titanium. Great. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, game. Really needed the titanium. Um, oh man, I'm, I should use my, um, <clears throat> my scanner. Like that, that'll tell me where all these limestone rocks are. Although I was mostly going to use it for sandstone since, um, Limestone seems to be a lot easier to find, all things considered. So, all right, let's um, let's get back up here. Uh, what else could I, what else could I tell a story about? What else have I got around here? What have I got around here? Hmm, I got a lot of things. Um, I got a little a little bird in a box which I took from my granddad's when he died years ago. That was like a decade ago. Oh my god, look at how much silver I've got in there. I need to start moving that stuff over to the other base. It's no good keeping it in here. So maybe I should do that right now. Uh, let me make this wiring kit. Um, and I should have the materials to make the thing now. Hold on, what was it I was making? Um, I forget what I was making. Oh right, battery charger with the habitat builder. Okay, right. Oh, God. Just oh, slowly losing my mind. All right, let's just take as many of these as I can over to the... Um, yeah, we'll take as many of these as I can over to the other base quickly. We have to keep this stuff safe. We have to keep it safe in my base. The life pod has become useless to, to us now. I'm going to have to name these lockers eventually as well and clear a bunch of stuff out of them. Uh, lead... Um, Actually, this this is the locker with the special stuff in it, isn't it? Yeah. So let's let's store all of this stuff in here, and that's good for now. And I think there's enough space in there to store the other couple of things that I've got. I think it's a two magnetite I've got. Okay, right. But before we go, let's uh, build the battery charger so I can charge these dead batteries that I've got. Um, okay. Let's place that right there. There we go. Wait, what? Oh, was it two titanium I needed? What? Um, I'm very confused. Okay, hold on. Ah, here we go. Right, I think I think we should be alright. And boom. Battery charger is done. Okay. Um, which, which ones have got low power? Pretty much all of these have got low power, actually. The laser cutter... Oh, God. I'm going to unload all my batteries. Hold on. We're going to do a little bit of battery inventory here. Let's unload all of my batteries and make sure I know which ones are low and which ones aren't. No battery, no battery, no battery. Wait, no. Repair tool. Yeah, that needs to be fixed. Um, no batteries. Flashlight. Unload battery. Okay, right, and repair tool, unload battery. Okay, right, let's figure out which batteries need the charge the most. Okay, 66%, 51%, 0%. Um, okay, that one can go in. Um, that one can go in, that one can go in. And what's the next? Okay, that one. So these, these ones, um, these three can go in in a little bit. Okay, let's drink some water. Um, Alright, those will all charge, slowly but surely. Um, and what's the other thing I can do? I suppose, actually, I can work on building the upgrade console. Um, have I moved everything? Uh, I'm going to move those other two magnetites. Hold on. We need to do that. Get that done in this video. Um, Alright. Uh, what else? What else have I got in here? Oh, oh wait, we've got a radio signal. Hold on, let's have a listen to this. Automated distress 
Another life pod signal. I actually don't remember how many life pods there are. Hmm. Alright, nice. Um, right, so we can finally move the last of these resources I've had stashed up in here. Um, I could probably move the stuff from the locker out there into into the life pod now. Um, all inventory management, basically. Oh, for fuck's sake. I need to I need to get rid of that. Or I could go over there and take a look. Either or. Um, oh, that's titanium. I need to name these lockers. It's going to really get on my nerves if I don't. Oh, wait a minute. No, this is the wrong chest for that. No, it's this one. This is the one. And then I've got these spare batteries here. Um, I can't really afford, actually, to go over to, to that, that life pod right now. So let's not do that for a second. Instead, um, let's figure out what I need for the... Um... Oh, wait, I don't have a battery in this, do I? So I can't. Um... Can I even check? No, I can't. I don't have any battery, so I can't check. Um... Oh, I do have a battery here. Hold on, let's have a look. Uh, vehicle upgrade console. Where are you? Um, ah, there you are. You need a computer chip, three titanium, and a copper wire. So I need two more copper, three titanium, and a computer chip. Which I think I can make a computer chip. Um, <clears throat> I think. Can't be sure. Uh, I'm going to need a few more copper then. I guess we'll leave this till next episode, I suppose, because uh, I'm going to need to actually go out hunting for the copper for this, um, which means I'm going to have to put the scanner on, and I can't do that while these are charging, because these will uh, it will eat up the the, uh, the uh, power that this base has. I mean, look, it's not daytime and the power's going down, so yeah, this, this is um, problematic to an extent. Uh, we might need to build a better um, power uh, maker so, I'm not sure. Hold on. Um, the bioreactor would be a good thing to build about now. Wiring kit, which we can build. Titanium and lubricant. Okay, we could build this, but I don't actually have the best thing for it yet. Um, although, I could go get it. I could go get it. I think I know where to find it. Oh, but I, I can't go down that deep, I don't think, with the sea moth. So, I'd have to, I'd have to dive down to get it. Um... Wow, we we're we're in a situation here. We we ha we ha we can't really go forward at the moment. We have to do a little bit of waiting, which is something that I haven't had to do this whole series yet. But yep, here we are. We have to wait a bit. Um, I suppose we can make use of this waiting time. Um, what? Do, how do I range upgrade this copper and magnetite? Okay, yeah. No, we need to find copper. We need to find copper. It's absolutely imperative. So let's scan for limestone. And this is going to drain the battery on my base very quickly. It's going to be very disappointing when my base just dies. Um, Alright, those are almost good. Uh, let's have a little look around and get these limestone chunks. Oh god, there's one just hiding down here. Um, oh, you've been here this whole time, you cheeky little boy. There we go, copper. Um, oh, is there some through here too? Hey, look at that. Uh, it's a titanium. Uh, there's one up here. Ah. Thank God for the scanner room, seriously. Absolutely saving my fucking ass here. I tell you, it is one of the best things to have. Just, just so that you can not have to worry about spending so much time hunting down these materials. You can just turn on the scanner and just go straight to where the materials are. Oh shit get my orientation correct here. Oh look, there's just titanium hanging about over here. Um, I wonder uh, I wonder if it will lead me to where that big old um, uh, coral tube was with the with the stuff in it. Because I don't actually remember where that was. Um, oh, hello. This stuff's inside. Um, oh, there's a cave right here. So I guess it's in here. There you is. There you is. Copper, baby. Um, alright, is there any, oh no, this is, this is, uh, this place is going to have one of those stupid things in it, isn't it? It's going to like jump out and blow the fuck out of me. It's going to blow me. Why don't you blow me? Um, oh, hello, is that a piece of 
limestone up there? Ah. Ah, there we go. Oh, it's titanium. Great. Oh, wow. The scan is finding a hell of a lot of this stuff. Bloody hell. I hope some of it's on the surface. I, I do, because I, I, I don't want to have to go hunting down in caves and get blown up by arseholes. Um, oh, let's drink another bit of water. Um, I might have to start hunting down bladderfish again pretty soon. Hopefully the batteries will be charged soon as well. Um, oh, we're at 25 minutes as well, so I'm going to have to stop in a minute. Um, <laughs> I try to keep these watchable, but sometimes I just don't have anything to talk about, so it kind of makes it a little bit like, eh, we're just playing. You can join me if you like. Like, like a bro time, you know. It's bro time, bros. Alright, now let's head back to base. Um, and I'm going to end the video here, I think. So, uh, next time we will, uh, I guess, build some depth upgrades, if I can manage it, and then try and get that uh, bioreactor built, because we're going to need it for the further well, upgrades to the base captain. and stuff. And Yeah, well, it's, it's going to be a long one, so don't worry. Oh, there goes the power. Hooray. No power left. See you guys next time. Bye.